Welcome everyone, you may be having troubles with the App Store on your iPod Touch not working, here's what you can do to fix it. So first of all, I want you to open up settings, and then find general, and then you see here date and time, make sure that you set date and time to set automatically. And the reason why is because you need to be in, you know, the correct date and time in order for you to sync with websites. Uh, so what you're going to do is you're just going to set automatically on, and once you've done this, you're just going to open up the App Store, uh, see if that solves the issue. I recommend you double click the home button, close out of it and then open up and see if it loads up. If it loads up, you're good to go. If it doesn't load up, the next step is to just restart your iPod. So to do this, you just hold down the power button until you see the slide to power off menu here. Slide to power off, give it around 10 seconds, and then hold the power button until you see the Apple logo, and then wait until you're brought back to the home screen. Now, the next thing you can also do is you can check the network. So what you're gonna do is if, let's say, you can't connect to the App Store, let's see if we can get uh, connect to other websites. So what we're gonna do is just gonna open up a, a new tab inside of Safari, and we'll just try and go to a website. Best one to go to is just you know, Google, something like this. See if Google loads, and if Google isn't loading, that means that the issue isn't with the App Store itself, but with the network you are on. So if Google's not loading, if all these web other websites are not loading, and the App Store also isn't loading, that means that it's the internet you're on, try another network, or try a mobile hotspot instead to access the App Store. Another thing you can also do is you can just sign back out of the app store and sign back in so how would you do that well you're going to open up the app store and you're going to tap into the top right to your username i'll show you how to get uh, get here if the app store like blocks you so then you just scroll down to the bottom and you see the sign out if you aren't able to access it from here instead you go to settings and on the older ios you head over to app store and then there's going to be a sign out option sign out and then sign back in but also at the top here you have your uh, name so i'm just going to move this out of the way Okay, the email I have isn't uh, is safe, so you tap into medium purchases and you tap into sign out here. So if you aren't able to sign out from the app store, you just go to here instead and then tap into the sign out. And then once you sign out, we need to do is sign back in. So the problem why you know the app store isn't opening, but all, uh, after, uh, the other websites opening is because maybe you change your Apple ID email or maybe something glitched out. So that's always the best bet. And once you've done all those fixes, really everything should be good to go. The app store should be fully working, no issues. If it isn't working, that means the app store is down. And so you just need to give it a couple of hours or so and then try again. And then you should be good to go. And the app store should be back uh, working. So hopefully this video did uh, help you out. If it did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're brand new. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.